I swear, man. Like, so far, Freya, like, put her on that list of most hated. <laughs> of most hated bitches in anything. Anime movies, anyway, anything. Put her on that list, because so far. She is not going to listen. And I will not freaking hesitate when going to a boss fight as her against her as Kratos. Sindri, I told you, I could handle it. But I don't think she's gonna help us. Ah, uh, where's your necklace? Huh? Oh! I was thinking, and I, uh, got rid of it. She took it, didn't she? Uh... Today was your lucky day. So, tell me, how did it feel to run on chaos? I... I just fixed that! <laughs> I'll repair it later. Let's get out of here before something else tries to kill us. Yeah, good idea. Hate to bring it up, but are we telling your dad about this? Since you've come clean and all. No way! He'd kill you! Right. Well, speaking of coming clean, I need your opinion on something. Something I've kept from my brother for a long time. I'll tell you on the way back. Come on. Come on. Did they ever do it? Yeah. Tower. You were saying? Long before you were born, there was an accident at the forge. Brock died. I couldn't accept it. I went to the Lake of Souls in Alfheim to steal him back. Legions of souls tried to stop me. I can still feel them crawling all over my skin. Thing is, 
I could only get three of his four soul parts back. Sindri. Brock just thought he got knocked out. I've been lying to him ever since. It's been eating at me lately. You have to tell him. He has a right to know. When the time is right. As should you with your father. That's not the same thing. Damn, you badass! You went to hell, well, the Norse hell, to get his soul back. You only got three pieces of it, but good enough. Damn. Anyway, you did a good thing. You saved Brock's life. I caused trouble. No. I made a choice. One that wasn't mine to make. So wait and see Kratos just be waiting at the door. <laughs> what do you mean? A choice? I... I couldn't be alone. The other dwarves, when they saw him, they shunned us. So we left. Made our own home. Well, you can't change the past, but it doesn't have to be who you are. Let's go home before Father wakes up. That might be the best idea you've had all night. Trey. Trey? It's a... Shut up. So I'm not allowed to give you a nickname? Is that what that was? <laughs> Whatever, Loke. Nope. That was worse. Oh, and I heard it when I said it. Call me that again. <laughs> Shall we? Tyr was such a failure. Just wanted now to hang on, little Yotun. Tyr may not be everything you expected, but a failure? You saved him from a terrible fate. That's not nothing. And hey, maybe he'll be some help to us yet. Maybe. But Father's not gonna go along with this forever. He's probably already got our next hiding place all picked out. Well, let's not make it worse by getting caught. When we get there, I'll cover our tracks at the gateway and slip around back. And you just act natural, but quickly. Thing to hearing directly from them. You are certain the giants will not cause a war? I said that they were wise. In my experience, that goes with being peaceful. Oh, little brother! Told you we need new water. The trace. Where have you been? Peen? Hope you're all hungry! I could eat. Is everyone as well rested as I am? Be right down. Is 
is this? this? Sausage? Sausage? Uh, sure. sure. Why not? Why not? I remember food tasting better. I suppose you'd like to try cooking for this lot. I accept. What? I'm sure that's where I'm planning our next move. Oh, so where are we going? I'll find I'm with the elves. Alphon? You hate Alphon. Why would we move there? Move there? Seeking information. The Shrine of Groa, young one. Your father tells me you found it there. Groa? The Knowledge Keeper? Oh, maybe there's a secret there I can unlock. Ah, you better than the seer who saw everything. I wasn't sure you, um... Never mind. That's great. I'll find Hey, don't go forgetting this what'll get you there. You know what? I'm gonna build a bigger table. <laughs> More for me. Tear, you're really up for coming with us? I am. Whenever you're ready. Well, whenever your father's ready, I should say. If my counsel might help you towards the answers you seek, it's the least I can do to repay you. Plus, I think it will do me well to see the light of Elfheim again. Hmm. That elf light is some good shit. So... Where'd this plan come from? Oh, from Mimir, of course. I was merely asking how you found me, and he explained the secret prophecies inside the Yodnar shrines. Fascinating. From there, I was sent to taking stock of which shrines we'd seen, at which point your father recalled finding growers outside the Temple of Light. And now that we can actually go to Alphine, the prudent course of action became self-evident. Nary a last step for the world's smartest man. Even without feet, if you'll forgive the levity. I was always fond of her talks, you know? Aye. And it's good to see you a free man again, old friend. And thanks to you as well, Brock. These clothes do better than I deserve. Darn straight! And never mind what Brock had to trade the landlord to get that extra silk seat. The landlord? Not the landlord. <laughs> uh, okay. did it. Tyr really slept in my broom closet. Is that normal for you tall, godly sorts? Or just the ones locked up for a lifetime or two? I'm here for you. Right behind you. I'll meet you at the gateway presently, friend. Mind if I take a little peek at you? I promise I'll be brief. My goodness, what a strapping physique. Capable of an astounding variety of acts of violence, I imagine. What is happening? The buttholes of this squirrel. This must be the squirrel that turns a wall tree. That delectable aroma. 
Could it be? Pardon the intrusion. Ah, yes. Amber resin. Delightfully nutty with a hint of squidding. No. Not one for gastronomic exploration, I see. Wait. If you're Raditz Hosker, why are you so different when we summon you for help? It's a long story. But you are correct. I am indeed Ratatosker. The one you know as Ratatosker is merely one of my spectral aspects. And the particularly nasty one at that, I consider him so far removed from myself that he's practically a different person. Speaking of... Bitter, would you like to come out and see your friends? I suppose that was to be expected. Anyway... Now that I've polished off all this regimen for you, would you like the seed back? It is the seed. Indeed. A seed of Yggdrasil, to be precise. Since my dwarven tenants performed their little reconfiguration, you'll need seeds like these to open up new destinations on my tree. <laughs> Your tree, huh? Yes, my tree. Here, let me show you. <laughs> 